Hey, what's going on? I'm James Allen Hill Jr. Welcome to my crib, True Vine Studios. I'm gonna give you a tour today of what we have and what we have to offer. Follow me. So right here, we have what you call the control room. This is my house, this is my room. This is my side, this is my area where all the technical stuff goes down, all the engineering, mixing, mastering. So to start, over here, we have two keyboards that we provide here for all of our musicians to play on, record with. Have the Mo XF8 and on top have the Motif ES7. Both great keyboards, great sounds in it. If you look here on this wall, here are some of the artists that I've had the opportunity to work with produce albums I've had the opportunity to play on. I'm still filling this thing up, so the journey is not over yet. Follow me over here. This is my baby right here. This is where every great beat, every great song starts. Right here on the MPC. I've been using this thing since I was 14 years old and never done me wrong. I love Akai products, they're great. All right, if we move over here, I have a rack space filled up, power strips, compressors, Presonus headphone amps, Focusrite, Octopres, everything to make the music just come to life, feel real warm right in your face, right here in your face. And that's what you want. Here at Truvine Studios, I'm running two Studio Live 24 channel boards gives me 48, total 48 inputs, which is a ridiculous amount, a ridiculous amount of inputs. So, got my board set up here. These boards are great for studio and live. That's why they're called Studio Live. That makes sense. Compression built in, reverb, effects, everything you need to make great sound of music, these boards have them. Here at True Brown Studios, I'm running Pro Tools. Uh, I'm on Pro Tools 11. So it's been working fine for, for me. I know a lot of guys, you know, have their quorums about it, saying it's not stable and stuff like that. But I haven't had any problems with it. So, you know, it's not broke, don't fix it. Have a pair of HS8 monitors that I use. Very flat, nice true sound. I love them. Makes everything sound nice. Nice and crisp, nice and clear. If you look over here on this wall, you'll see a couple of my accomplishments, things I was able to do. I was able to release my first single last year called I Owe You Everything. That's available on iTunes, go check it out. I also made the Fedville Observer for that song, which is awesome. Then above that, I have my certification in audio engineering when I graduated from school. Right there, Re Recording Connections Audio Institute. And I'm also currently in Bible college, getting my degree in biblical studies. That's the control room. So follow me over here to this room. Take you over to the live room. All right, over here, we have the live room. Nice big live room. Here is the singer's place to get it going, get it getting on. However, you want to do it. The microphone's right here. We do choirs in here. This is a Rode NT2A microphone. I love it. It's a nice, great, warm sounding microphone, especially running through my Twinfinity. This microphone has different pickup patterns, figure eight, cardioid, also has 80 hertz cutoff and 40 hertz cutoff, and then it has a pad, negative 10, negative five. So, great mic, can handle high sound pressure levels. Awesome mic. Full set of drums, we got my hot stage customs for drummers. Have them tuned up nice, sound really, really good. Have a Hammond organ. This model right here, I believe, is a A100. It has a speaker built in the bottom, and it also has the Leslie on it. So, this thing can, can get pretty loud. Uh, I'll play it for you real quick. Especially when you 
way you run the headphones. Right here, have guitars available. Ibanez, Fender, uh, Ibanez Acoustic, Fender Electric, and a Fender Bass. So, this is the live room, and I'll give you a shot of it what it looks like with the lights off when singers are in here recording. So, come right here, put on these bad headphones right here, and go to town. But yeah, it's the live room. One last room. One last room. Follow me over here. This is the break room. So, when you bring food, when you bring drinks, when you bring food, this is where you eat it. Great place, helps keep the studio nice and clean. Don't have to worry about spills and drops over in the control room or in the live room. So I have this space available for you too. I'm really glad you all were able to share the day with me today. But our meeting has come to an end. Subscribe to my page. Stay tuned for more videos and studio sessions coming to you directly from me, Hilltop Productions, and James Allen Hill Jr. Thank you. God bless. Have a great day.